If you want to know more about gender identity and expression, you should definitely watch our picks for the best transgender movies. Number 10. Tangerine, directed by Sean Baker. With unconventional tropes and filmmaking at its best, Tangerine was shot exclusively on iPhones and follows a transgender sex worker who is bailed out of jail. When she learns that her boyfriend and pimp cheated on her, she embarks on a desperate mission to find him and teach him a lesson. She wants justice, and no one can stop her, not even her best friend. She's some white fish, I don't know. Yes, there's fucking she know me with real fish. Yeah, bitch, like a real fish, girl, like vagina and everything. I've been gone for 28 fucking days, and you mean to tell me that he's been out here she know me with fish? Yeah. Number nine. It's Lily. <laughs> That's right. I know his cousin from Violet. My dear. The Danish Girl is a 2015 biographical romantic drama film directed by Tom Hooper. This beautifully filmed and staged biopic drama explores thought-provoking themes of the modern times. Once again, proving the unspeakable talent of its leading cast, the Danish Girl follows an artist who was born in the wrong body, now preparing for the first-ever sex change operation. But in times like these, struggles are even worse. Luckily, his long-loving wife is on his side. He said that you would sit and you'd Look out together, beyond the fjord, to the sea, to the future. We had big dreams, yes. Yes. Number 8. Breakfast on Pluto, directed by Neil Jordan. This 2005 comedy drama revolves around the story of transgender Patrick Kitten Braden in a 1970s Irish town, who sets out on a search for his mother. The movie raises issues regarding a struggle with identity and a lack of understanding received from conservative societies. The comedy drama sort of shows us the same world we live in, but through a completely different dimension. Please, don't do that. As you wish, sir. Number 7. I'll never understand why you're doing this to me. I'm not doing anything to you. I'm gender dysphoric. It's a genetic condition. Transamerica is a comedy drama film written and directed by Duncan Tucker. With powerful performances and a witty take on transgender themes, Transamerica uses its thoughtful title to tease the central road trip plot. In the midst of important changes in her life, a transgender woman learns that she has a 17-year-old son. When she bails him out of jail, she must face the fact that the boy has nowhere to go. So you've done it. It's all over. I don't think that's any of your business. <gasps> Mom! Oh my God, Murray, he's still a boy. <gasps> Number six. Non, tu vas mettre ça. Oh, j'ai pas envie. Écoute, tu discutes pas, tu mets ça. Tomboy is a French drama film written and directed by Céline Sciamma treating its subject with warmth and intelligence. While delivering a striking coming-of-age movie, Tomboy is the story of 10-year-old girl Lori, who, upon moving to a new town, decides to present as Michael. Dressing in boys' clothes and cutting her hair short, she faces all kinds of new struggles and prejudices from friends and neighbors. Number 5 a bloody good little performer, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I thought we were getting away from all this shit. The Adventures of Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, is a road comedy film written and directed by Stephen Elliott. Despite being loaded with laughter, comedy, and heartfelt humor, this road trip movie is also full of tender emotions and mature themes. When three drag queens make a trip through the Australian desert to amaze fans of drags and enrage homophobic citizens, they must also face their inner demons. We're unplugging our curling ones and going bush, Felicia. Why would you possibly want to leave all this glamour for a hike into the middle of nowhere? Do you really want to know? Desperately. Number four. Okay, superstar. Wow. What's with the shirt? Boys Don't Cry is a biographical film directed by Kimberly Pierce. 
taking on a horrifying story defined by bravery and love. Boys Don't Cry follows the journey of Brandon, who was assigned female at birth, but managed to build a relatively normal life as a man. But when his ex-girlfriend's brother finds out he is transgender, threats force him out of town, and the brutal friends of his past follow. I might even want to fuck you. You mean if you was a guy, you might even want to fuck me. So you're a boy? Now what? Come on. Number 3 Lawrence Anyways, written and directed by Xavier Dolan. Exploring societal norms, aspirations, and the journey to breaking them, Lawrence Anyways is set in the 90s. When a young man confides a truth to his girlfriend that has bothered him his whole life, the two face families, prejudice, and hatred to fulfill his biggest wish, to become a woman. <laughs> Number two. Give it up, Wang Yi. Give it up, Quang. Hedwig and the Angry Inch is a musical comedy drama film written and directed by John Cameron Mitchell. Inspired by the ultimate classic Rocky Horror Picture Show, but becoming its own masterful musical experience, Hedwig and the Angry Inch follows a troubled aspiring musician who is the victim of a botched sex change operation. As an ignored rock singer, he must fight his way to stardom while also fighting his own inner demons. This is actually the first song I've ever written, and it's written for a guy to sing. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. No way. You said anything, girl. Girl has to draw the line somewhere. I want to change it to a man. Why? It's a secret. What do you expect from that treatment? What will that change? It's out of luck. Mm-hmm. Shake balls to get in and out. Why are you rolling your eyes? I'm fascinated by this something that happened. Mm. Is it that uh, something got hot? Is that the something that happened? Ew, come on, you like my sister. Hey, no. Hey, come on, just a no. sit. No. Number one. I thought you were the best one on stage. I bet you say that to all the girls. <laughs> but thank you. Soldier's Girl is a biographical drama film directed by Frank Pearson. Taking on timeless topics with modern themes, Soldier's Girl portrays the journey of a young soldier who starts his army career at a base camp in Tennessee, where he meets a fellow soldier struggling with a drug problem. When the two sneak out to a bar one night, our hero is fascinated by a drag show, but his fellow soldiers stand in his way. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.